Pipe fans all over the world, it's Daddy Pete on the corner in the corner boxing. Man, they got me, y'all. They got me. You know, I can't I <laughs> I can't fault nobody but myself, man. They shut my channel down. I went live last night. And uh, I guess I was being a little too generous to the fight fans. I was trying to show a little highlights between the rounds. And uh, I guess I showed a little too much. But anyway, this Daddy P, I'm back at you, man. Look, on the corner, in the corner, boxing. And check it. Um, I hope I can reach out to my fans and my uh, subscribers from a other channel but uh hey, hey if y'all hear me out there man go ahead and resubscribe subscribe to this new channel uh my other channel will be back and um but hey i'm still doing it for the fight fans man i love the sport of boxing so you know i'm on it you know anyway this fight last night man look this was a real good fight man and i told y'all in my prediction video <laughs> I wish I could put it up, but uh, they got me struck down. So, man, uh, I predicted that Mikey Garcia by unanimous decision. I, now, what I did not know, I ain't know Mikey Garcia was going to be able to, to flow him, to knock him down. But, man, he put Sergey Lipinitz on the canvas. I mean, wow. Now, all through the fight, Mikey Garcia was landing the more punches but i'm gonna tell you this sergey limit lipinitz was landing some hard shots and he uh he got mikey he had mikey leaking from the nose or somewhere man i think he was leaking from his nose man he was bleeding pretty he was gushing pretty good at one time but anyway mikey garcia he stayed very composed his experience showed he continued to he look he established his jab early, and uh, he moved very well. Uh, you know, something I said also in one of my preview videos. He moves very well. His offense and defense translate very well back and forth with the type of footwork he uses. And man, it's a thing of beauty. And um, he never did linger on the ropes every now and then. Sergey Lipinitz would uh, have him up against the ropes or try to get him in the corner. He might tee off with a couple shots, but Mikey would always be able to spin out. And um, man, look, Mikey Garcia got the W via <laughs> unanimous decision. And man, look, like I say, I'm blown away. Mikey Garcia, even at the 140 pound division, displayed, excuse me, he displayed not only his defensive prowess, his heart, his chin, but also his power. Man, I was I was blown away, man. I was very blown away. But Mikey Garcia, he's a real smart fighter, and that's something I talked about in one of the previews, man, is that he is very smart. He knows his way around the ring. Um, he's under the tutelage of his older brother, Robert Garcia, who is a former champion, and Papa G, Papa Garcia, that's both of the, those guys' dad. He been around the sport for a lot of years. Um, and, you know, hey, those guys got... Mikey Garcia, man, he been around the sports. Just, you know, he probably couldn't even spell the word gym and was in the gym. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, you know, he get it honest, man. He get it natural. So a lot of that stuff come natural to him. But, uh, man, look, I was blown away, man. Um Sergey Lippin is a guy without a lot of experience, but he did what he was supposed to do. He outboxed him. He even displayed his power. What else can you say, man? Fight fans all over the world. Hey, Showtime Premier Boxing Champions has brought us the goods all year long so far. And man, look, we about to come, we about to get to mid-year. And um, hopefully they'll reveal the second half of the year, man. But this thing is already lit. Listen, we got Anthony Joshua and Joseph Parker at the end of the month. Listen, we just had a heavyweight banger last week. Listen, <laughs> man, look here. We got so much good boxing. Next month, we got some good boxing. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know, man. This is a very talent-rich pool of boxers right now 
in the boxing community right now. Fight fans all over the world, we ain't wanting for nothing. We got fights on top of fights. We got this um, middleweight division, man. Look, they cooking real good, man. 160. Then you got 154. They cooking real good. You know what I'm talking about? Welterweight. I ain't even got to mention welterweight. Heavyweight. Listen, cruiserweight. We about to have a undisputed cruiserweight champion. Listen. <laughs> man, look here, man. Boxing right now is probably like, hey, it's a golden era in boxing right now, man. That's all I can say. So fight fans all over the world, y'all stick with Daddy P, man. Go ahead and subscribe to this new channel. Hit the bell icon and uh, you'll be notified every time I go live. So, hey, I'm going to still be going live. If you don't have Showtime, if you don't have HBO, I will be giving good boxing commentary during real time, during the fight, letting you know what's going on during the fight. Look, <laughs> I'm going to try it again, y'all. But check it. Y'all stick with your boy, man. I'm out of here.